this is Phil Hood with Drum Magazine. We're here at the Summer NAMM Show 2015 in Nashville. I'm here with Mike Maliti, who is a custom drum builder with a difference. And uh, we're going to talk about some of the differences in his drums, uh, even though it's noisy in here. Hello, Mike. Listen, I want to I want to ask you right off. Um, you build stave drums, and so I want to know a little bit of the of the technology and thinking that went into the design. Sure. Well, uh, in stave construction, uh, there's a fraction of the amount of glue. Um, the drums, before it's lathe round, it looks like a wine barrel. It's a faceted circle. And uh, the only glue is at the joint of each facet. And um, after we uh, lathe it, it then, only then it becomes a circle. And we're able to, um, we have a fraction of the amount of glue in, then in plywood. And uh, the grain of the uh, wood is running vertical to the shell. When plywood, it's always horizontal. So we're able to transmit vibrationally more easily uh, using the wood uh, vertically rather than horizontally. All right, one of the things that you've said to me and that we've heard is uh, that your drums have a lot of the wood sound, the sound of the wood. Can you, can you talk about that? Sure, well, um, as in stave construction, you do get more wood tone just with, uh, just with the stave method alone. Uh, then we put a bearing edge that has a flat top on it and that alone uh, transmits more head vibrations throughout the shell as well. Do you, uh, what woods have you built with and do you feel you get the distinct characteristic of each different type of wood with your construction? We do bubinga, we do a lot with bubinga actually. Um, the walnut has a, has a deeper tone. We do the purple heart to get the high tones that we want, a uh, little bit more high end, uh, a lot of resonance, high end resonance. Then we do the ash, which has the, the, a lot of low end in it. Uh, we've worked with cherry, maple, birch, uh, ash, oak, uh, mahogany, a coca bolo, uh, bubinga, purple heart. We, we, we stock we stock ten, ten different types of woods. What uh, now? These are these are uh, quality drums. What kind of uh, prices do you do you have at the retail uh, level for a drum set? Well, uh, the price only varies based on the type of wood we use. The, a lower end kit is not necessarily a worse sounding kit. Uh, the ish and the uh, rest of the domestics were probably, for a five piece kit, around the $3,000 range. Uh, and then the mid kits are probably around the four to $5,000 range. And then you have the Purple Heart and Bubingas, which are probably in the five, uh, six to $7,000 range. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's take a listen to the drums, even though it's noisy in here. <laughs> <laughs> 